Okay, now the big question, the honest question. What is your weakness, my Christian? No weaknesses. None. Zero. <laughs> now that's called high self-esteem. I guess you gotta have that. You really oh, must yeah. believe. Listen, Mike Christian came from a tough background. He has made it. It's not been easy. He has overcome a great deal. And here he is in all of his muscular endowment. Incredible physique. And look at him play to the crowd. He was the only one, I mean the only one, Chris, at the weigh-in that played to the crowd. He understands the charisma part of it. He loves it. He's a hand. <laughs> He's a hand. Mike Christian with a great upper body. The calves are going to be slim. We've talked about that genetically. It's going to be a problem. How do you right. build up the calves? But you know, he's improved 100% since last year on his calves. Uh, genetically, it's a hard part for some people. Uh, high repetitions are very, very good. I believe in 25 to 30 repetitions per set. Not so much heavy, but just burn them. Get the blood in there. This is a great routine he's got going. Yep. Get that. Christian, will he be Mr. Universe? He's going to have to beat up Barry Denay. It's awesome, that sort of power, size. Chris, what's Barry Denay thinking right here? He's probably not thinking anything and probably not even looking at him. He doesn't want to see him. <laughs> An excellent routine by Christian. That takes care of the individual stuff. Comparison, Moses, that's all coming up on ESPN. Stick around. In second place, winning this silver medal from Holland, Barry DeMay. Boy, almost an apologetic uh, announcement from wow. Albert Buzak. And look at DeMay's face and look at Christian. It's a shame that somebody has to lose because it they is. were so it's close, true. Chris. It's absolutely true. It's very close. And they're both such great champions. It's too bad, as you say, one has to win, one has to settle for second. Mike Christian, the winner. Let's Great go back winner. and get it from Albert Busek. And here is our world champ in the heavyweight category, Mike Christian, USA. Boy, that's what it's all about. Betty and Joe Weeder raise the hand of the champion, Mike Christian. If a smile on a face tells it all, that tells it all. Mr. Universe. Mr. Universe. Chris, I gotta ask you, Mike Christian Mike versus Christian. previous champions, does he stack up? He more than stacks up, Irv. He's among the best ever. Five years ago, you didn't see that kind of size and muscularity, that combination. It's unheard of. All right, what's ahead for Barry DeMay? He has finished second two years in a row. I predict Barry DeMay will come back even better and win the darn thing. He's got to. I'll tell you one thing, these guys cannot uh, just walk in and get a suit off the rack, and I include you two. Where do you guys get your clothes? Well, you know, Verb, that's why we stay in sweat clothes. <laughs> we have the world's worst wardrobe. <laughs> I don't believe that for a moment. That's what it's all about. Mr. Universe, and our champion in the heavyweight classification, is Mike Christian. It was tough. It was close. I would hate very, to be a very judge. Tough. It's very May. It's too bad that one man has to be second. They're both so impressive. Mike Christian, so happy. All of that hard work. You live on 300 calories. You sacrifice. It's all paid off here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Mike Christian, he is Mr. Universe. 1984, the winner. And he's still posing. <laughs> yep. Can't stop. I told you he was a hand, didn't I? There he goes. All right. Christian, the winner. He uh, wins out over DeMay. Stick with us. We'll come back to Las Vegas, Nevada, right after this. Here's the biggest man in the contest at 6'1", 245 pounds, Mike Christian.
Mr. Universe, Mike Christian, was interviewed by MVJ at the 85 USA in Las Vegas. Mike mentioned his competition at the 85 Night of Champions. Well, I entered the Night of Champions three weeks ago, and I took like fourth in it, and that was due to traveling. I did some traveling ahead of time and did a few things that I normally didn't do. I listened to other people as far as my diet. I was like three or four pounds off. Three or four pounds in a professional ranking is, is uh, like three or four placing. Mike's posing routine is great. I'm hungry and mad because I'm not first no more, you know. I'm fourth, I'm back down to fourth, so I'm hungry and I'm angry, so uh, this Olympia will be something to see. I will be very, very unbelievable. At the 86 Pro World Prejudging, Mike's physique is sensational. Take a bite. Audience at the Pro World's evening show loved Mike's routine.
captured the runner-up spot at the Pro World. Mike's a great athlete and person. Winning the Mr. Olympia title is definitely in Mike's future. In third place, third place, $13,000, that belongs to Mike Christian. stage I'm like hey watch me flex you know let me show you what I've done all year so I really enjoy myself
Here's Michael. Now, Mike has really got a nice closing routine for us tonight. And he hit his peak just right. He looks a lot better than he did at the Olympia. He was right behind you at the Olympia, finished fourth to your third. You know, it was, um, it was a real accomplishment for me to break that top three of the Olympia, and there were a lot of really good athletes. Not all of them can make it. What are his strengths and weaknesses? Well, I feel that Mike has exceptional upper back development, shoulders, and arms. Uh, I feel that uh, he has overall a very, very good world caliber physique. I think that what hurts him perhaps is the leg development. And packing this all on a six foot two, 245 pound body. Mike is over six feet, two inches, and 245 pounds. Yeah. It's just incredible. He was by far one of the largest men in the competition. And you know what? He is the proud father of a new baby boy. Rock in the style. Rock in the cradle. Mike has also got one of the best personalities. I remember doing shows in the early days when he would uh, not win and hold on to that, that goal of being great. And then he goes on and is now one of the top pros. He really hit the pitch for this one. Look how hard he is. And is watch this bad shot. Mm. They are just going crazy. We love him. For good reason. He may be the winner of the next contest. We'll have to see later, but it's going to be the winner of the so far. It's going to be close. How would you judge? I think that Mike will probably take it tonight. This is my opinion. However, Brian is going to be in very close contention. Yeah, great music he's posing to. A reflective of his personality. He really has a lot of personality, and in fact, many of the bodybuilders, as in all sports and everything I've ever experienced covering sports, the best have it all. They have personality, they have sense, they have a lot to offer. I'm proud of you. Listen to all the applause. Michael Fitzgerald. We'll be back with our final competitors as well as go backstage and see the. The two fellows we thought would be the finals. Look at standing side by side. You can't Christian. It's going to be really close, really close. First place in the 1988 Pro World Championships is Mike Christian. Yes, sir. It is Mike Christian. Brian, you have to tell us a second tonight. Tonight. And how happy he is. No, Mike, I don't even hear you. The cash doesn't hurt his feet. Sure. I never hurt anybody. <laughs> all that work, all that vindication, you're the best body on stage among the best pros in the world. What a feeling. Happy for you, Michael. There's, there's Joe Weider to put the first place medal around Mike Christian's neck. Look at that physique on Joe, huh? If I know this place. All right, we'll finish it up.
Hi Christian from USA. You had him going. You had him going at the end. Yeah, I worked real hard on his routine. I spent like two days in a row, eight hours each in a studio, and I had a choreographer, Tony Bacena, and worked real hard on it. You know, I know it's uh, one third of the, the judging, so I want to make sure that I was going to get that end of it. <laughs> you know, and I would think, too, first major event of the year, you want to kick off the year the right way. Yeah, um, I'm definitely right up there, and I think the, this routine hopefully will knock me right over to the edge and take off the number one uh, place. Off to a great start. Good luck. Thanks, Fred. Appreciate it. We'll present the third prize. Third place, $15,000. Third place, Mike Christian. Mike Christian. <laughs> Mike, push it!
think I'm going to win. I mean, I came in this show in the best shape of my life. I feel real good. I'm very confident. I've seen the competition. I'm one of the biggest guys on stage, if not the biggest. <laughs> and I think I'm, I'm really sharp. I'm in great shape. So uh, they compared me with Lee Haney. I feel very confident. Uh, you know, so we'll see how it goes tonight. Unbelievable. Mike Christian has never made a more dramatic entry in his many years in this sport. 31 years old now. Something he's been waiting for. Rock hard. Mike's known for that rock hard muscularity. Iron Warrior in Chainmail. Look at those trifles just hanging out of his arms. That's it, Mike. Mike Christie's signature shot there. Watch the... Muscularity in the shoulders, in the neck. Mike's known for his great arms and his great delts. In fact, uh, he's even trained his arms and his delts in the offseason if they get too big. Too big? Yes, yeah, seriously. He loses symmetry that way. Only trained him before show. Oh, he's in great shape tonight, Greg. Great shape. Nice move for a big man. Very nice move for a big man. Look at try oh my, do you see that shot? There it Super is. Super razor blade. Very flamboyant on stage. Wow. Look at the cut in his back, you rhomboids. You could lose your wallet in there. Best back so yeah. far? Oh, definitely. I think most plywooders would love to have a, fly, a back in Mike, Mike Christian's. I think back, arms, delts is definitely Mike Christian's. Warrior is a man of steel. Lee's happy on stage, isn't he? Sustained applause from the audience. Just about the time it's fading, he makes a new move, and they just can't resist clapping again. Light on his feet is so graceful. Just for a big man. 6'1", 245. God, look at this delta nice shot. Mike Christian. Tom Platt's on his way backstage to try to catch up with this great athlete in the inaugural WBF Championship. Remember, $100,000 first place prize. The audience is getting their prize right now. An encore from Mike Christian. The Iron Warrior.
inside your own I get to man, baby, yes, I know But I need you, I want you Oh, man, I love you so Ooh. You're gonna see, I'm gonna run, I'm gonna try I'm gonna take this love right to you Oh, my heart, all with joy, oh, baby